right fellas let's begin our journey or to explore this whole town of Hogsmeade I got the swag the drip let's look around Beverly 11 Oh wait. There's some new stuff in my inventory. Oh. All the plants and stuff. Is my potions restored? Hogs oh, need. Check out the map. I don't want to miss all the uh, the flu flames, so let's turn back. Let's get that one. How inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. I could imagine. And it was one more. Over here. It looks like we can't really enter these buildings. Rebellion. Let me get the flu flames, I'm getting distracted. I also don't know where to get the wand. What's this up here? Some money. What's this place? Uh, potions. Got Handy it. resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Let's check out this building here. Welcome to J. Pippin's potions. Revelio. Established in 1753, it's the apothecary in Hogsmeade where a proprietor Perry Pippin sells a wide variety of potions and their ingredients. There's some stuff down here. Twilight Cloak. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion-making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. 
I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Seems like an important place. Okay, get our free healing potion. Eridurus potion recipe. It says recipe for a potion that causes a rocky film to develop on the consumer's skin, helping to protect them from harm. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory, or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Wow. Expensive, man. Need to make a lot more money. It's for combat. And get some swag. This is my gear that you can sell. Okay. Ooh, now I have five healing potions. Rebellion. There's some stuff underneath here, like how do I get down? Maybe this behind the shop? I'm sure there's more than meets the eye in here. But we'll be back. Let's check behind the shop to see a chest. Revelio. Oh, was it inside? Oh, it was right here. It was below. Oh, it's another one of those that we can't open, man. What's the deal with that? I'm gonna be pissed off because I found so many and when it's time to open them, I'm gonna forget where I found them. That sucks. See a chest here. Rebellion. 50 coins. this it's one of the pubs damn the head is alive Rebellion. Damn, Just drinking it for free.
guess we can head over here. It's this place. Library. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. All right, that was a part of the uh, the main quest, I believe. Revelio. I'm gonna check upstairs. Rebellion. Ah, oh, something up here. Some free money. Finally. I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Uh, mm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand? Yes. It's about time. Yes, I... About time? Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest one-makers in the world. 
It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Hmm. Uh, no, 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 not you. Um. Ah, yes. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Hmm. No, not you. Uh, ah, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, thirteen and three quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. All right, it's called a notched warm brown black thorn phoenix feather supple <laughs> 11 inches. Okay. Intriguing. Curious indeed. How intriguing. Curious indeed. How intriguing. Curious indeed. Dragon heart string that serves as the core of the wand, known for producing powerful magic. Hmm, a unicorn hair wand is most reliable and faithful to its owner. What about this? Great range, consistent. Powerful. A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Yeah, clearly, I'm going with the most powerful. How intriguing. I was thinking about this one. Spiral Ash. It's kind of cool. It's like Groot from Marvel. How intriguing. Curious indeed. 
Curious indeed. The wet type. How intriguing. I don't see the change. The hell? Curious indeed. What do you think? Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new one's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Alright, let's search this place if we can. I don't think we can. We can't jump. Revelio. Oh, well, we got the wand. Oh, hard work and good Visit the magic leap. We'll get there along the way. Be some stuff to do upstairs. Rebellion. Oh, look at that. Three broomsticks. Long standing gathering spot for villagers and hogs watch students who want to enjoy a butterbeer or fire whiskey. Oh, three stories. There's a lot of stuff in here. Rebellion. How tall is this building? Can I collect that through the wall? Nah, I can't. That would be some cheese. Wait, what? Let me go up like a hundred steps. Ah. Uh, it's only a level one though. Why can't I unlock anything? I'm level five. I guess we need the unlock spell. Then we can start doing that.
Revelio. Pranks and jokes. Rebellion. Dung bomb. Rebellion. Accio. Not level six yet. Rebellion. Now we level six. Being in here. What a lovely treat to have you walk by. Be sure to pass by at least once a year. Twice if you can. Rebellion. Another one of those chests. Oh, so he doesn't talk. The guy was levitating for a second. Okay. It's the same building. Rebellion.
had to do it. Shop. Magical meal. Should have a bunch of gear now. Yeah, here we go. Does it do anything? I'll keep the handle. This one gives plus six defense. Legendary, wow. Ooh, it's fire. Same stats, though. Like this hat, man. Gotta keep that on because it gives me defense. Ooh, plus six offense. I'm looking crazy right now. Ah, I like how we can actually put it on. We can keep the stats without showing it on us. I like that. Pretty fly right now. Even with the scarf. Okay. Looking spiffy. They want us to go over here, I believe. Revelio. I wonder what Merlin would think of a wizard in 
I mean, there's a reason why I got these things. But I'll run there. Just to explore some more. Rebellion. Okay, I've been here before, but not across here. Rebellion. It's exactly what I was looking for. Akio. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dipney seeds? Let me guess, you're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Well, that's everything. Better go and find Sebastian. Okay, so that was everything. Wow. Revelio. Didn't even go inside. Isn't there a door? I guess not. Rebellion. Barber or something? Diamond casual school uniform and it's an upgrade. Ooh. Damn, my stats going up crazy. Nice. It actually looks good too. Pace to explore, guys. Rebellion. Hello. Oh, come in. Come in. Welcome to Madam Snelling's Tress Emporium. <laughs> I'm sure I've no need to introduce myself. They used to call me Snelly. Oh, Snelly. Why aren't you studying to be an aura? But I showed them. 
They're stuck in the dust at the Ministry and I'm here thriving. <laughs> Absolutely thriving. But look at you. Look at you. I can certainly see why you paid me a visit. Looking for a change, are we? Wow, it's shade. She says she can see why I came here. <laughs> what a diss. But this is where you go to change your hairstyle, right? Yeah. Why so. not, I say? What sort of change? Some are going for that muggle with consumption sort of death becomes me allure. But you won't find poison oh, here. But you have to pay for it, no right? need for chloride of lime or ammonia when you have magic. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like to look? You can change your hair too if you'd like. What services do you offer? What is it you might be interested yep, in? Yep, that's what I thought. So we can come here and change. Um... I had messed up on the complexion because it like I was trying to see if it would change and it didn't until the cutscene started. That's just for the freckles and stuff though. Yeah, it's kind of weird. I'm good. Anything We're else? Just, you're just walking around taking people's purses. Getting some good gear by entering these buildings though. The ones that's unlocked that is. I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. Nice. Uh oh. What's going on here? Randomly. Huge. Ah, oh, they have the red, the red glow. Damn, I gotta fight this guy. Can I actually? I still can't fight. This is so dumb, bro. Lumos. Why can't I hit him with anything? Hold on, hold on a second, bro. I'm getting annoyed right now. Why can't I fight back anymore? It's gotta be a reason. I didn't forget the controls. Or do I have to... Uh, did I forget something? I literally can't fight anymore. Or was it R2 just to do it? Let me see. Ah, oh, there you go. Damn. 
damn, bro. Ancient magic. Damn. The dual god. Alright, so I just forgot my controls. It was R one just to hit. A set control. Did you two take on a fully grown troll? No, I did. <laughs> I suppose so. He's just distracting. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they yeah, were. Repair of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Damn, so in that duel, I could have been beasting and feasting on these hoes, man, but I was... I totally forgot to... <laughs> I don't know why I thought it was square. I'll go and see what he wants. Um. Rebellion. Accio. Well, come. Repairer. Lucky they didn't do more damage. Revelio. Repairer. One less thing for us to sing to worry about. Repairer. 
Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. I sell even more battle-worthy items. Should you be inclined, you're most welcome. shop at your leisure. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. I would like to know how to unlock these, uh, Doors, man. The hell was that? Ah, uh, you said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who's this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Oh, that's the guy who was following us in the beginning. <laughs> Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Man, I saw something I need to collect. It was hovering right it's over a them. Treat to see you, Lord Gog. 
I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Man, she got a deep voice. Now, what can I... Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. What the hell's going on? It's the wrong voice. The attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Is this not trying to be trans-positive or something? Like, I will say, for the trans people? Trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Uh, uh. Wow, he found us. How timely. Does he know it's me, though? Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. Wow, they put a trans character in the game just my because of J.K. Rowling. A well -earned butter beer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the ominous. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butter beer forever. Was this originally in the game or did the update do this? You've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. The voice doesn't match the face Harlow at all. And Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Well, if, uh, he's definitely going to find out. I think we should head back to the castle. That was clearly a trans character. What the fuck? The pandering is insane. <laughs> oh man. Well, I've been in this building before, so I think I've unlocked everything. Is this the same building? With the stairs? Yeah, so we've been in here, collected everything. I need to go back to where we saw those guys. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Arlo. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. Damn, do I still have to play dumb? With uh, Miss Weasley? Because she is definitely going to know now. He knows and he's going to tell her. And she's going to be like, whoa, you beat a troll. How did you do that? <sighs> Hold on a second. Oh, well, there's still a lot of uh, field pages to be covered here. So it's okay if I miss that one right now. I can fast travel to my common room? How? Okay. I guess I was next to a fast travel point.
I guess they don't want us outside at night. As students. Got a curfew. Alright, perfect timing, man. About to end the episode right here. I'm loving the swag. And I like how you could put clothes on, items on. If it doesn't match, you can still keep it and make it invisible and still get the upgrades with it. That's crazy. I've received an owl post. Okay. All posts will be sent when characters you've met have requests or updates for you. Come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found at Green Guts. Okay. Man, this game keeps impressing me. The graphics, the fighting, the story, the lore, the amount of things to do. It's just going to keep increasing. But guys, let's stop it right there. If you're enjoying it, leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and I'll catch you in the next episode. Peace out.